So a few months ago, I thought of a mod idea that I really want to come to life. So I decided to take a C-sharp course online over the summer so I could start developing it. However, I struggled with procrastination and stopped after a while. So this fall, I enrolled in a computer science class at my school. So a couple days ago, I began working on my very first mod. While I had limited knowledge about Rainworld's code, Ole Coley, the creator of the Binky Slick Hat, spent over an hour and a half helping me with the basics. The very first mod that I wanted to make I knew would be simple would be Rocket Fisher, and then from there I want to make more complicated mods until I can work out my way to the mod that I really want to create, because I know it will take so much work to get done. There's more stuff I could say, but this intro has already been going on for 40 seconds, so let's just get into it. After a long process of trying to get my mod to at least work in the game, I finally was able to do the double jumps in midair, but it had a small issue. It would do it multiple times per input. I'm having a weird issue. Uh, if I do the artificer jump, it does it five times, then it stops. Like, I have this old max already jump, so it would use it five times. And if I try to do it slowly, like just tap it, sometimes I get it once. Oh, damn, I got it once each time. But usually it does it like one to three times if I just tap it as quick as I can. Oh, I can't do that. But... Yeah. I'll explain this quick, but basically when artificer jumps, it broadcasts artificer jumps equals true. So I made a code that says when it's true, turn it to false. And it did it 40 times a second, so if you didn't let go of the inputs, it would just do it again. Obviously that's not what I wanted. The problem is when Ole Kole helped me, that works perfectly fine for him, so what what gives? And not this one either. <laughs> Still instant, but I float now. And then I broke her again. <laughs> what did I do? Artemiser, this isn't you. <laughs> I forgot to add an if statement, and without it, that means the code was always active, so Artificer was constantly in the flip animation. So at this point, I was messing with the code for a couple hours, and I didn't know what I was doing wrong, so I went to the Metropolis low gravity area to see what it was like there. Okay, so this is like what I want. I can't jump down though, but it won't matter. But, like, if I hold it, it doesn't do anything, so, hmm, I'm doing something wrong. So I tried to copy over the code that was already in the game, and I have it act like low gravity, but instead I just got this, I copied the wrong part of the code, it was my fault, but, Artificer, you saint, I'm telling you. I get some more help from Ole Kole, but basically they just tell me what I did wrong and what to do. And I finally got it to work. And here's my reaction. Okay. Come on, final test. Yes! <laughs> it works! Yes! Oh my gosh, I've been working- it's 5 o'clock. I've been working at this since 8 o'clock this morning. Today! I've spent- what? That'd be eight, four. I spent nine hours on this today, and then like a couple hours the last couple days. Oh my gosh, it was so simple. <laughs> oh, it works. You can fly. Okay, definitely have like a higher. Have a higher capacity. You run out pretty quick. Maybe I'll boost the stupid uh, but um boost the launch distance so you can get launched up higher. But I don't know, I'll figure that out later. Maybe an uh, update or something if I do it. Fly! <laughs> oh, this is sick. We're going to Moon City. That's Artificer. This is so cool, <laughs> yes! <laughs> so yes, it took me nine hours to figure out two lines of code, but it doesn't matter. I learned a lot, 
on my, that journey, and I was super excited once I finally got it done. It was worth it in the end. And now I get to test my mod out and have some fun with it. Okay, I gotta test this. Let's do like some combat. Uh, Metropolis. Where's the toll? Warm. Temple toll? I know it's a different toll. Alright. Oh my god. Oh god. I'm sorry, my game just crashed. Just for me with this having my mod, I would have cried. It bounced off me. Reigns of Terror! Yeah! Oh no! <laughs> I got you! I tagged you first. That's not fair. <laughs> um. My bad? There he is. Wake up, wake up, wake up! No! <laughs> Alright, dang it, let's try that again. I sniped them! Well, holy crap, that's sick! Alright, let's go back. Oh, I forgot these guys are here. Not anymore. I got bounces! Hell yeah. Get over here. I mean, stay over there. Hey. What was that? Alright, still not a match for him, but I have a better chance now with my new mod. <laughs> wow, now it's come full circle. I'm making videos on my own mods. <laughs> it's ridiculous. So, for anyone that is even thinking about modding, definitely check out the video I have linked in the description. It is a video made by one of the most prominent modders, Hemdez, I think is how you pronounce it. They have a three-part series on modding. It's pre-downpour, but it's still matches. It helped me out so much. Definitely check it out. I'll have my mod linked. It's on the Steam Workshop right now, so please go check it out. Give me your feedback on this type of video. I never made one like this before, and I don't really know how to quite do the editing. I kind of just gave up at the end. And please consider subscribing if you haven't already. It means the world to me. And just have a great day. Thank you for sticking around.